Uh, this is my, actually my showmanship heifer. Um, just, she won her class at the World Eye Fair this weekend. And she actually was pulled out for champion selection. It's just fun, because they all have so, but they have different attitudes. Like, people don't believe me when I say that, but every heifer, you can just, you can bond to them differently. They, it's just funny to see how they act. You get pretty connected with them, <laughs> seeing them every day. We have three kids, and all our kids uh, really do a lot of stuff on the farm. And one of the things we do as a family is we do a lot of showing together. And the kids are responsible for washing the cattle, breaking them to lead. You know, it, it's almost a full-time summer job to get their projects ready to go to the fair. Yeah, so Lauren uh, has been showing, uh, I think she's been showing for eight years now. One of her specialties is showmanship and being able to take that calf that uh, has never gone to a show and work with it and understand how to get her to lead and to to show her off the very best way and you got to win gracefully and and humbly and it also teaches you to when you lose to not carry on and make a fuss you just got to accept that somebody else won today and you know if we go congratulate them you hope someday they come get congratulate you and you have a good day. My mom and dad started this farm in 1961. They uh, started milking with 40 cows and kind of grew to uh, over 80 cows kind of in the early 80s and uh, kept that size till I came back from college. And uh, I was home from college about five or six years and we grew to the 400 cows that we have today. Well, we milk three, three times a day, uh, and then uh, basically, uh, you know, a dairy runs 24-7, 365 days a year. There's always cows to feed and cows to care for, and so we have registered Holsteins, and, and uh, we really try to use the best genetics available. Uh, we're breeding for kind of a complete cow. We want a cow that uh, looks good, produces a lot of high component milk, high protein, high butter fat, and we want that cow to have a, a good udder, good feet and legs, and be very feed efficient so that the feed she consumes, she turns to milk. And, uh, and then we also concentrate uh, more on the health traits all the time, so we want a cow that uh, is easy to breed, easy to calve. So we're always looking at our farm uh, every day to get better, figure out how to get better. And when you're selecting for genetics and selecting you know, based on data, is you need to have data that's managed well and uh, from an organization that has a lot of integrity. And, and I really think the Holstein Association does a really good job of sort of summarizing, managing that data in an unbiased way to give us the very best information that we can use on the farms. Five or 10 years from now, where we want to be is we just, we want to keep improving our dairy herd and uh, continue to you know potentially have opportunity for my kids to come back to the farm and the Holstein Association helps us get to our future by you know having the offering the programs that we can use to you know evaluate what kind of cows what kind of Holstein cow is the most valuable and helping us sort of move our herd in that direction and uh, it's a big part of our team. <laughs>